Hi friends, happy Friday. So for our last book of our farm unit, I chose a super fun and silly story about farm animals because I wanted to end our week with um, some little giggles and laughing. The book I chose is called I Love My Hat. And if you look at the front cover, you'll see some of the silly things that you're gonna see in the story. There's a cat with a hat on. There's a pig wearing a scarf, and it looks like a goat wearing a coat. So how silly is that? So goat coat rhyme and um, cat and hat rhyme. So the author of this book is Douglas Florian, and the illustrator is Paige Geyser. I love my hat. And there is a farmer. One autumn morning, Farmer Brown got on his tractor and headed to town. Soon he saw a calico cat. Nice hat, calico cat, said Farmer Brown. Thanks, said the calico cat, and he started to sing. I love my hat, I love my hat, I love my hat, sang the calico cat. Hop aboard, said Farmer Brown. Soon they came across a nanny goat. Nice coat, nanny goat, said Farmer Brown. Thanks, said the nanny goat, and she started to sing. I love my coat, I love my coat, I love my coat, sang the nanny goat. Hop aboard, said Farmer Brown. Soon they came across a big white ox. You see the ox? Nice socks, big white ox, said Farmer Brown. Thanks, said the big white ox, and he started to sing. I love my socks, I love my socks, I love my socks, said, sang the big white ox. Hop aboard, said Farmer Brown. So are you noticing the rhyming in this funny story? So we have a cat hat, goat coat, ox socks. Let's see what's next. Soon they came across a field mouse. Nice blouse, field mouse, said Farmer Brown. A blouse is another word for a shirt, like a nice shirt can be called a blouse. Thanks, said the field mouse, and she started to sing. I love my blouse, I love my blouse, I love my blouse, sang the field mouse. <gasps> Hop aboard, said Farmer Brown. And soon they came across a pig in the sty. So a sty is another word for the fence, the area that the gate uh, that the pig lives in, where their mud is. It's called the pig sty. Nice tie, pig in the sty, said Farmer Brown. Oh, I see. It's not a scarf. It's a tie, like a tie that a man would wear. Thanks, said the pig in the sty, and he started to sing. I love my tie, I love my tie, I love my tie, sang, sang the pig in the sty. <gasps> Hop aboard, said Farmer Brown. And soon they came across two turtle doves. Now a turtle dove isn't a turtle at all, it's a type of bird. There are these white birds called turtle doves. Nice gloves, turtle doves, said Farmer Brown. Thanks, said the turtle doves, and they started to sing. I love my gloves, I love my gloves, I love my gloves, sang the turtle doves, doves gloves. Hop aboard, said Farmer Brown. So look, they're all on the tractor or in the wagon. Soon they came across a big brown bear. Nice underwear, big brown bear, said Farmer Brown. Thanks, said the big brown bear, and she started to sing. I love my underwear, I love my underwear, I love my underwear, sang the big brown bear. Hop aboard, said Farmer Brown. Bear rhymed with underwear, bear wear. <gasps> And soon they came across two caribous. Nice shoes, caribous, said Farmer Brown. 
thanks, said the caribous, and they started to sing. I love my shoes, I love my shoes, I love my shoes, sang the caribous. Shoes, caribous. And as they pulled into town, the animals sang. Farmer Brown, you need new clothes. Dress yourself up from your nose to your toes. Off I goes, said Farmer Brown. So now they're in the town and notice Farmer Brown's got his old clothes on. Let's see what he does. And when he got back, he sang, I love my clothes, I love my clothes, I love my clothes, wherever I goes, I love my clothes, when the autumn wind blows. And that is the end of our story. I love my hat. So I thought that was a great story to practice identifying some rhyming words and also just to laugh and smile because these kind of stories, these fiction stories make you feel happy. And I thought that was a funny, funny, silly story. I hope you liked it too. Have a great weekend, boys and girls, and I will see you next week for our last week of kindergarten. Yay!